Morning everybody, uh, out at the field today with my newly completed uh, RC Powers F18 version 5 uh, <clears throat> that I did uh, several di uh, different modifications to. Um, almost looks like I realized today it's almost a bit of fall colors there, but anyway, um, please check out the comments down below um, for the details on the build and the modifications that I made to it. Uh, so today I'm just going to give her a quick thrash. So I moved the motor uh, forward by an inch uh, to counteract the weight of the paper of the Dollar Tree foam behind the trailing edge of the KF airfoils. Um, and I also wanted to see if I could get the, pull a few G here, Yeehaw! get the weight further forward to uh, improve uh, high alpha performance. Um, Unfortunately, that didn't work out too well. I'm, I won't demonstrate it to you because my, my high alpha skills and confidence are pretty, pretty bad right now and I'd have to do it up too high. Um, I gained maybe five to 10 degrees AOA. So with my previous stock build, I could maybe hold about 25 degrees AOA angle of attack with this maybe about 35, which is still not quite scale. Um, and when wing, wing rock comes on, it's, it's pretty violent. This plane actually, I, I, I took a few things from the F-18 version 3, which I've had, you know, hundreds and hundreds of flights on. And it actually flies more like a, uh, with more F-18 version 3 characteristics. Um, bit, a bit more forgiving than the... Then the stock one, not that the stock one was crazy scary to fly or anything, but this one feels uh, just a little bit smoother. <laughs> so I'm at about uh, 20.6 ounces, I think, with a 2200 three cell. Moves along uh, really, really nicely. I might have created a little bit more drag, but with the mods that I put on, but I think it's compensated somewhat with uh, the fact that I built it out of thinner foam, but uh, still just a ton of fun to fly. F-18 version five. And, oh, sorry about the sun. All right, we gotta do one more pass here. <laughs> All right. So no flaps or anything here, just beautiful gentle descent rate. Okay, so uh, just quick and dirty on the mods. Uh, you can read more details on uh, uh, when you check out the links below. I'm just going to disconnect my battery. So my battery ended up way ahead of uh, where it is on my stock uh, plane. You can see, oops, you can see the battery there. It's probably, I'm gonna say an inch and a half, inch and three quarters further ahead. Um, my CG on this one, it took me a while to get the CG dialed in. This, this is the stock CG and my CG is like there, about an inch, inch ahead of that. Um, so I, I widened the lurks, they're probably about three eighths of an inch wider uh, right here where they join the wing and then sort of, you know, taper in. Again, the motors further forward, uh, different tails, sort of V3 size tails. I put the dog tooth uh, on it to make it look uh, more like a super hornet. Um, but like I said, it, it didn't, uh, unfortunately it didn't really improve the high alpha performance. Uh, as much, but uh, overall, I think I, I really like the flying experience. Um, you know, it, the, the, this moment of inertia here is, is uh, quite a bit longer than what I normally like to fly uh, my planes, uh, but it just feels very, very smooth, very, very balanced. A um, little bit, like I said, I think it's a little bit more uh, forgiving and relaxing. Um, so somewhere in between the V3 and the V5, but because it's so much smaller, it's uh, certainly a lot quicker than uh, 
then the V3 uh, is to move around because you know you got a much shorter wingspan, much shorter body. Uh, anyway, so I'll think about it some more uh, for some more ideas on why I didn't get the improvement in high alpha that I wanted. Maybe I should have left the motor further back again, lengthen this uh, moment even more. But uh, anyway, exceptionally pleased with this. Uh, the F18 version 5 is the my second favorite in all the V5s next to the uh, F22. So uh, thanks very much for watching folks. Blue skies, calm winds to everyone. Park jet noise, the other sound of freedom baby. Take care.